Power Lap Quick Start Video 2 Hierarchies and Aggregate Weights This video shows how to add additional members, create hierarchies, and add aggregate weights. Dimensions are composed of detail and aggregate member types. Detail members add up to aggregate members. For example, in the months dimension, January, February, and March, which are detail members, add up to quarter one, which is an aggregate member. To add new members to a dimension, follow these steps. Go to the Model tab and click Dimension. In the dialog box, select the Accounts dimension. Click Edit to open the Accounts Hierarchy dialog box. Or you can double-click on the Accounts dimension to open the Hierarchy dialog box. Click the Create New Members icon. You can also right-click within the Member list box on the left and select New. Enter net sales. Click the icon again, or you can press Control Enter keys instead and enter cost of sales. If you plan to enter several members, it may be easier to continue to press the Control Enter keys instead of clicking the Create New Members icon repeatedly. So let's press Control Enter and enter gross profit. Click the green check mark icon at the end of the icon bar. You're returned to the Dimensions dialog box. Double click on Regions and click on the Create New Members icon. Enter South America. Control Enter, enter North America. Press Control Enter, enter Total Regions. Press Control Enter, enter Colombia. Enter Venezuela. Enter United States. Control Enter and enter Canada. And then click the green check mark icon. Once the members have been defined for a dimension, the hierarchy of these members must also be defined. The hierarchy determines the aggregation of the dimension members. You'll now create the hierarchy by selecting members and moving them from the members list box on the left to the hierarchy definition dialog box on the right. Follow these steps to create a hierarchy. On the dimensions dialog box, double click on accounts. Drag Gross Profit in the Members list box to the Hierarchy Definition box under the Accounts. Click Net Sales and the Shift key, and then click Cost of Sales. Drag them to the right under Gross Profit. Now the Sigma symbol appears beside Gross Profit. Click the green checkmark icon. You are redirected to the Dimensions dialog box. Double click on Regions, drag Total Regions on the left under Regions on the right. Drag North America on the left under Total Regions on the right. Drag Canada and the United States on the left under North America on the right. Move South America on the left to the right to become an aggregate member of Total Regions like North America. Move Venezuela and Colombia on the left to the right under South America. Now the Sigma symbol appears beside Total Regions North America, and South America. Click the green checkmark icon, and you're redirected to the Dimensions dialog box. Aggregate weights are used when a member in an aggregate must be assigned a multiplied value in relation to other members in the aggregate for the data to be properly represented. In the Accounts dimension, for instance, to arrive at a calculation of gross profit, Cost of sales should always be handled as a negative number because it will always represent an amount subtracted from net sales. To weight cost of sales, complete the following process. Double click on accounts. Double click on cost of sales in the hierarchy definition box. Enter negative one. Click the green check mark icon and you've just added an aggregate weight. Excellent job. Thanks for watching. Visit parastech.com for more information.